Hi, and welcome back for this episode number six, the second to last one in our series of our Sustainability Knowledge Center. Glad you stuck with us through a myriad of topics, some easier than others. The topic today are the Sustainable Development Goals. Facing the complexity to quantify the impact of sustainable investing, the SDGs have contributed to a common language understandable for everyone in the society. We will delve deeper into what they actually are, where they come from, and what they can mean to you and your investment portfolio. The Sustainable Development Goals were originally created by the UN in 2015 and replaced their predecessors, the 2000 Millennium Development Goals. But where the MDGs were created by experts to target mostly social progress, the SDGs were created by all of the UN stakeholders, like member states and civil societies. As a result, they went a lot further and covered all dimensions of sustainable development, environmental, social, and economic, for all countries, regardless of the level of their economic development. Although originally developed for countries, nowadays SDGs aren't used solely for governments, but act as a common language used to discuss companies' sustainability policies and performance. The original three dimensions of ending extreme poverty, fighting inequality and injustice, and fixing climate change translated into 17 goals. These often do not directly apply to companies and therefore must be adapted. Also, there are no standardized metrics for measuring SDGs, leaving room for biased ESG reporting and, in some cases, even SDG washing. Nevertheless, SDGs have quickly become the reference framework for reporting on sustainability for the private sector and nonprofit organizations. SDGs help give better visibility to the ESG impact of investments, an impact otherwise still very complex and difficult to quantify. As society pushed the boundaries of sustainable investments, no one can just afford to not invest in the worst companies of the peer group, but has to finance the real economy for a real sustainable growth. And because of the huge investments needed to make our societies more sustainable, the contribution of businesses is imperative. SDGs play a key role in revealing, highlighting, and measuring their contribution to sustainable development. At De Groove Peter Cam, we've been pioneering in sustainable sovereign bonds with our own proprietary model that predates the SDGs. We understand the impact of sustainable investments, not only on an investment level, but also its powerful potential as a collective move. Because, working together as a community, sustainable investors can really change the situation. Something we'll further explain in our next episode on proxy voting and shareholder engagement. So, now that you know the ABC of SDG, we hope you can better refine and define your strategy. Be sure to stick around for our last episode.